Hey guys, welcome back again. Um, we are going to be working on the letter N, as in Nancy or Natasha. Um, let's see. Uh, so I couldn't think of anything, and then all of a sudden it just hit me, and I was like, duh, napkins. <laughs> I got a couple. <laughs> so... Um, I think the ladies did nature and uh, I could do that, but I have a lot of napkins, so I might as well use them, right? So we did teeny tiny tags before, so now I'm going to go back to the larger ones here. So I'm just going to grab three tags. Bloop, bloop, bloop. By the way, I love these tags. Uh, she doesn't have any more of this size. I wish she did. She might get more in. I don't know. I know she's got some digitals up, so I don't know if she's like going digital instead of, you know, making them like this, but I have no idea. So this is the one that we used on some previous projects. I'm going to have this one and then this one, which is really pretty. The Eiffel Tower. A bike. I actually really like the bike. Um, Beatrix Potter. Another Eiffel Tower. Some flowers and some more flowers. And I think these are the same. Yeah. So. Um, I think... We're just going to start, I think I'm going to start with this one because it's already here. And I do have my water this time. Uh, that way I don't damage my brush. So, I don't know if I want to do Mod Podge. I'll probably just do Mod Podge on the bottom and then um, do, what you call it on the top. Sorry, I was looking for my wax paper, but I don't think I, yeah, I do. Since I don't think I have any out, but I do. Alright, so, you need to move up the weight. Grab my big old fluffy brush. Boop, boop. I love this thing. It's so soft. Sorry, I'm done. Maybe, possibly. Alright, um, it's the eyelash trim. There's a lot of stuff that's like in my way at the moment. I don't even know where my Mod Podge went. It disappeared. Oh, more napkins. Surprise! So, oh, we can do the black one. I like the black one. Do this one just because it's like the odd person out. It's like a it's a luncheon napkin instead of a squared napkin. Um, oh, I buried it. That's why I couldn't find it. Like, where did it go? Buried it way back in the back. Open sesame. So this is my Mod Podge jar, for anybody who doesn't know. It's one of these that has been decorated. It has been falsified. That's not a thing. I was just being silly. Alright, so I'm going to put the Mod Podge over here on my mouse pad because that's a great place to put it. And... They might cover this side because this is going to poke through, I think. Yeah. All right. Are you ready? Oh, no, we're not ready. I have to start a timer. Oosh. Oh, it doesn't recognize me with my thing on my face. All right. I almost cheated. And we could also do it in spots. I mean, that would be cool. All right, 
I'm just taking some of the excess off because I don't need all that. Alrighty. Mirror. Mirror you. Yeah, see, it still posts there quite nicely, I might add. Okay. So there's one. And then. Hold that. Mm, scissors. So there's one. Ooh, we can make a set. I got to feel about that. I like how the image pokes through. That's really cool. All right, and then I think I'm just gonna seal it with a mod podge out instead of opening up the other one. Over there. Come here. Come here, are you? I feel like I should have music on or something in the background. Can't do that. YouTube will yell at me. Like you can't do that. Yeah. Twitch does it. How come I can't do it? Which is weird. I ask Wayne all the time. I was like, how come Twitch can play copywritten music, but YouTube can't? Like, what is that? Cause I'd like to have music playing in the background, you know? That's cool. I like that. Alright, set you over there. Next. I'd like to say I'm a music person, but somebody asked me, you know, who plays this or who sang that or whatever. I'm like, uh, a band with a singer that may or may not be male or female or old or young. Like, I, I have no idea because, yeah, I, I don't know anything about that stuff. Oh, it's too short. It's too short. Abandoned. And that's just me trying to get all the wrinkles out. Oi. Sorry, I got quiet. I was concentrating on not cutting what I didn't want cut and cutting what I did want cut. And I 
still missed. There we go. All right. So what I like about this one is, is you can use every bit of this napkin and you'll get different images on each one because of the design of the napkin. It's pretty cool. First, I try to get all the wrinkles out and then I add the Mod Podge and it puts more wrinkles back in. Makes total sense. Alright. What are you? I don't think this one's sealed to the bottom. Somehow. I'm not sure how to do that. We shall figure it out. Away. So we use all three the same napkin. Hold that. And we still have some napkin left. That's why I love using napkins because you can use one single napkin and get so much out of it. Even the teeny, teeny tiny ones. You get so much out of a napkin. It's pretty awesome. Lego. Lego my scissors. I was say Lego my ego, but it's my scissors, not my ego. There we go. Alright. Hold that. Hold that. And. Alrighty. So, I don't know how to edit using this program. Not that I would edit anyway, because even back in the day when I had an editing software program, I still didn't edit my videos. I don't know why. I just, it's just such a lengthy process. Anyway, I'm telling you because I'm fixing to turn on my air dryer thingy. And if you don't like it, you might want to mute or fast forward. Because. It will be loud. Boop. All right, put that in there. That. If I could get it to screw on, right? There we go. That in there. I think we're done with that for a while. Um. All right, where are you, blow dryer? There you are. All
All right, so I'm just going to let that one sit for last because this one has a little bit more glue on it, so it's taking longer. So I'm just going to set it over there. All right, now let's make them pretty er. Pretty er. All right, so I've got two tags here. They're cool. I like it. All right, um got this lace here I've been playing with um, kind of off and on. Let's put this off to the side here. This one here. I really like this one. I think I like this one because of the design of it. It's just, it's different. And I like layering laces because it's cool. Because ah! it's cool. It looks good. Then again, I like layering all kinds of stuff. It doesn't matter if it's laces or not. Oh, warm, 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 warm. Okay, okay, okay. All right, we're going to grab my box of pre-made embellishments. So somebody asked um, recently if I made the hearts. The hearts, I did not make. Everything else I did. Well. Any of the quilted pieces, I did not make it because I don't, I don't quilt. Um, but all of the other pieces I did, like these pieces, I did not do this. I bought these from another artist. Um, she's actually on vacation right now, so I don't know. So she doesn't have any available anyway. But uh, these I did make, and I'm wondering. Uh, I think we'll do this one. I kind of want to see the rose up here. It's this one. So I think I'm going to leave that like that. And then I kind of want to add some of my eyelash. I love this stuff. This stuff is awesome. It would be more awesome if I could find the end of it. Not that it really matters, because, I mean, you just cut it apart anyway. Ah, found it. All right, so I'm going to go right about there. All right, go over there. Hold that. Whee! I am doing a couple things right now. I am coloring it. Just not white, just barely off white. And I'm also opening up the little thingies because I'm going to wind this up and then I'm going to stick this on top of it. So we're going to put that right there. And then. That right there, just like that. Let's spread it out a little bit and then put this right on top, like that. Open this up and push this down. Okay. 
just like that. And voila. But if you make pre-make embellishments, it actually saves you a lot of time. Um, let's see. There we go. Um, let's go with this one. And I always lose the end. There it is, this one. Now we're going to color this too. Right. Not the lace. We're not going to color the lace. We're going to color the this. And I'm just using coffee. Coffee color, not coffee, coffee. And this is Archival Ink. I've had this for many a year. I'd say probably about four or five years. Something like that. It lasts for a minute, that's for sure. Alright. Um, you over there. Where'd you go? There you are. And then take this and push it in there. Voila. I like it. Now, let's do this one. Alright. This one. My squeaky chair. Ooh, we could do a tag within a tag. That'd be fun. Um, I just made mini tags, so I have them. I don't know that they would match this, though. They might. What? I'm just going to do this and this. another layer of stuff. And honestly, how I make these is I just have a bunch of stuff on my desk and I just grab stuff and I put it on there. Does it look good? Nope. Try something different. Could it possibly look good? All right, stick it down. Let's see what happens. That's that's how that's how my world works. Ooh, I like that. I'm sure a lot of you are like yelling at me right now. Oh my god, blue! Why blue? Um, for one, I like blue, but for two, I just like color. Like I. I really enjoy adding color to pieces. And I know that I have pre-made embellishments that will match this lace. And I'll show you. Okay. That. 
there. And voila. We could do this one though. Is it kind of poking off the side? I like that. Alright. Don't throw your containers. Alright, so we're going to go with the trim again because it's fun. And I have a bunch of it and I'm trying to use it because I have so much of it. Like, honestly, just having one skein of this stuff is so much eyelash trim. And that's just the white. That's not including the colors that I can't necessarily use in, like, stuff like this. Because the other one, well, the other one actually would probably look really good. The other one that I have is this one here. And yeah, we're gonna go with right there. We're gonna actually cut it. Um I have others, but they are not handy. And I'm not really coloring this as much as I am just opening it up. And you could use your fingers too. Just pull it in the opposite direction and make it go poof. Make it go poof. Alright, so I'm going to put you right there. Out. Don't touch. Alright, and then. You back over like a soul and then oh it's too short too short I need you wider So it's actually um, a little short, so I have to kind of make it go where I want it to go. And by doing that, or how I do that rather, is just instead of gluing the center points, I glue kind of all the way around it. That way it just kind of stays open. So when I put this down, it goes that way. Oh, you can't even see what I'm doing anyway. I moved the camera up and then I scooted down. Makes sense. Um, so anyway, I just kind of glue across the, the out instead of just gluing down here to hold the two pieces together. I glue kind of all the way around. Just to tack enough to tack it down. So it'll stay. And then we add our pretty pretty. Here. So, ah, oh, that's warm. All right, that's cool. I like that. And then we 
punch a hole. I just stabbed it because it's just napkin covering it. So I just stabbed it. And could just like do one of these little doohickeys like that. I kind of like that. All right, that's what I'm going to do. All right, so I'm going to cover the hole right back up. Yep. And then across this side. And then find the end of this thing. Where are you, end? Alright. And I've got another piece here. Out. And then. Another piece there. Okay. And trim that. And then. I have pretty stuffs over there. And let's go with actually kind of like that. All right. Um, let's see. Go right there. Okay. I'm going to do one now. And not glue my fingers, hopefully. Perfect. Oh, that's cool. That's really neat. I like that a lot. I actually really like the combination of the blue and red. I'm not sure if y'all do, but I do. I think it's cool. All right. So the last one is got 12 seconds. We have 12 seconds to do the last one. Done. <laughs> I'm going to wait for this to go off and then I'll finish the last act. Uh, stop. All right. So we failed and by we, I mean me. Um, yeah, napkins takes a while to do apparently. Uh, maybe it's the adhering the napkins or whatnot. I don't know. I mean, technically speaking, we did do a napkin tag, but I would add more to that before I used it personally. So that's exactly what we're going to do. All right. I'm going to go. Oh, I've got this piece over here that I need to use because I cut it. So. Open you up a little bit. Then I'm going to put it off to the side and then I'm going to cover it up. And why put it on, you ask? Because I'm not covering up all of it. 
just some of it. I think I have enough to go across to all of it. So I'm just going to cut it and then use the rest of it to tie it. Whatever we do with that. Not sure yet. But. Right, so we'll use that to tie it off. And then let's see. What else do we have over here? Got this linen. I think that might be covering it up a little too much. Got this lace bit over. Come out, come out, come out wherever you are. Oh, goodness gracious me. Okay. Just wanted this piece. Um, you all can go right back in there. Oh, what are you? Come here. That's pretty. I might use you. Okay. So, I'm going to take this and do this or do this. Or this. I think I like this one better. Yep, yep. Yep, yep, yep. Anybody ever seen that movie? Land Before Time. Ducky. Yep, yep, yep. I had a. Our childhood friend growing up, his nickname was Ducky because he was so small. I don't know if people still call him Ducky. I mean, he's a grown man now. He's got a couple kids. I think he still lives back home, but... Well, back in southern Alabama. I think home is where the heart is, and... It is very hard for me to say that my heart is there now. So, I've always believed that my home is where my family is. And my family loves me unconditionally. Not conditionally. It's, uh, that one's a long story that I'm so not getting into over a on a YouTube, but basically, I just, I don't really call anywhere home except for where my family is. Like, I know nothing about Tennessee, but I would, in a heartbeat, call Tennessee home, because that's where my daddy lives. That's really pretty and elegant. I like that a lot. What if we put these pretty little pearls right down the middle of that? Oh, that is nice. I like that. Could even darken these up some too if you wanted to with this uh, archival ink. I wouldn't do it with oxide because I think it would just come right on off of the oxides or with the oxides rather. But the archival, sure, it's permanent. Ah, don't glue your fingers. I'm actually supposed to be making something for my um, my stepmom, um, but 
I feel like I'm so out of my league on that. It's a journal, but it's so different than anything I've ever made before. And I feel like I'm very much out of my league. Um, I don't really know much about this particular type of book. Although I do have a very nice resource. Miss Eve, she is helping me a lot. Because she knows, because she lives in Switzerland, right? So obviously she knows a lot about the Norse and the Celts and stuff like that. Because, you know, that's where she's from. <laughs> Um, so she's helping me out a lot, but yeah, I'm just, I guess I'm intimidated by it. I don't, I want to do her justice. I want her to enjoy the book and have use for it. And I, of course I want it to be pretty. I wonder... I'm just cutting the thing off. I was wondering if I could cut it in half, but it's plastic and it's pretty thick plastic, so I think the answer to that is no. That is really cool. I like that a lot. I don't know that I want to put anything else on it. That's really pretty. Let me look. I, I want to look. I don't want to just be like, no, nope, we're done. There we go. We'll put purple on there. <laughs> Ooh, pink. Although the pink one might not be bad because there is pink here. That's actually not bad. Oh, wow, that looks really cool. See, this is why you always check. Because you never, ever know. There's a big one. That's too big. I need more colors. Come off a of vacation. I love these things, though, because they're quilted, right? And I don't, I don't quilt, so. Um, I'm lucky that my sewing machine even does you know, fabric to paper or paper to fabric because my sewing machine and I don't really get along very well. I'm pretty sure it hates me. All right. Oh, that is so, so cool. Oh, 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 that is so cool. I don't think I'm going to put a ribbon on this one, though. I don't know. Should I? Should I do it? There's a little bit more pink. We could just put it down like that. Oh, or we could put it in the back like that. Not necessarily this one, but. Hmm. Or you could just tie it in a knot. I kind of like that there's nothing there. I think I'm going to leave it like that. Kiss. Keep it simple, stupid. I love that phrase. Not that I love calling anyone stupid, but. Less is more sometimes. Not always, but sometimes. Just don't tell the least I said that. It might get its feelings hurt. All right, so now that we are 15 minutes past due, uh, I think, I don't know. I don't know exactly when I started the clock. I just know that the video is at 45 minutes right now. So we've got the sun here with our napkin. This one here with our napkin. I love this one. Maybe because it's got the blue, but I love this one. And then, I don't know, I, just, I think I like all of them. <laughs> then again, you should like all of them. You should like 
what you do. So there is that. And those are done. And voila. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I had a lot of fun going way past my deadline. Um, but come join me in the next letter, which is an, an O. It is O. I'm not sure what we're going to do with that, but we'll figure it out. And I will see you guys then. Thank you so much for watching.